Yeah, I had, I had a bad feeling about that mission, I'm not gonna lie. Hierarch, one of our combat units can be assigned a new faction. Hierarch, my scouts are tracking the movements of the Golden Armada. Probably being led by some. We have received new robotic siege technology, Hierarch. Please make your selection. Fire Attacks at the ground to or set fire to the ground, damaging enemy ground units. <laughs> Automatically builds scarab beds. chosen as the world Cybros was to orbit. For thousands of years, it has been a research retreat. Here, Protoss scholars secluded themselves from political affairs to focus on the task of devising technology that would benefit the Empire. The Psi Matrix was first conceived here. When it was decided that the purifiers would be shut down, they became a symbol of achievement, but also the dangers of it. So they were brought to a research colony. Where better than a place where our greatest scientists resided, constantly improving Cybros' stasis field. And how many resided on the world below? 800,000 Kalai, a contingent of Templar. I only hope their deaths were swift. Yeah. There's been a lot of loss so far, and we're not done. Your plan worked, Kerax. The stasis grid is down. We must act now. If we can bring Cybros online, the battle station should begin to defend itself. And the purifiers? They have lain dormant for millennia. They may still harbor anger towards us. If they turn on us, we will have to fight. We failed them before, not understanding what it was we had birthed. These personalities may be replications, but they are alive. After spending so much time with Phoenix, I share your belief. Cyros will not be able to resist the Zerg for long. We should move quickly if we hope to save the purifiers. I require your honest counsel, Phoenix. Do you believe the purifiers will join us? I do not know. They may harbor rage, resentment for the actions of our forebears. The Daylong is not the Conclave. We are united in purpose, like never before. And that is why the purifiers must be allowed to choose their fate for themselves. Without freedom, a people can be controlled, but never united. This is true, and yet, the firstborn have ill need of another enemy. And I believe in you to not create one. Your actions determine the future for both the Templar and the Purifiers. But now is the time to act, Hierarch. You are right. The way forward may be difficult, but it is necessary. Thank you, my friend. Okay, we'll be honest. I don't even know if I have enough to play Phoenix and Shield Overcharge. So after this mission, I should be able to do shield overcharge. Uh, okay. Oh, we get to talk with him. This will be good. I assume your plan is to bind these robotic warriors to your will. They will be allowed their freedom, much like Phoenix. Making slaves of them is what led to their revolt before. This foolish idealism taxes my patience. Idealism? They are the replications of our greatest champions. We seek to free your people from Malash, and yet you desire to enslave mine? I care. I care not for freedom that softens a people. I will dethrone Malash and save my kind from oblivion, but they will not be free. They will serve me. Freedom is a delusion. Grant
handed to the weak by the strong. You speak as Amon does. For the sake of your life, that will change. It's still the Phoenix Machine as the new executor of the Purifiers, and use them as the tools of destruction they were built to be. With the stasis grid down, the Zerg have begun infesting the surface of Cyros. We do not have long if we wish to see the purifiers. Alright, so let's get going. Really, this big ass ship, they're already all over, but I could believe that. I wonder if we're actually going to uh, find out what happened to that Protoss ship. That Kerrigan infested. I don't remember at all. Where they let the Protoss be warped back even though she was infested. I do not remember that at all, really. So. I don't even remember that plot arc, how it ended. I just remember the like, betrayal because you kept her around for so long. These Zerg are truly as tenacious as the Archives claim. Their infestation already spreads across the surface. And Avon's hybrid has begun fortifying the hives. Must hope for the aid of the purifiers to win this battle. Indeed. According to the station's schematics, Cybros's power architecture is divided into four distinct quadrants. Each is sealed by three null circuits. Destroying all of the circuits in a quadrant should restore its power, activating at least some of the purifiers. We will need to keep a watchful eye upon the poor matrix. If the Zerg destroy it, Cyrus falls as well. Try to locate the null circuits as soon as it is safe to do so, Hierarch. Artanus, there are unpowered cannons placed near the core matrix. With enough fortification, this would be a defensible position. They didn't even give me a cybernetics course. I really just cannot do anything. You have not enough minerals. I return to serve. I heed the call. Time this goes up, it'll probably our be cannons. Yes. Really good at having a nice and quick turnaround for a lot of stuff. Yes. For, for this playthrough, at least one of the quickest turnarounds I think I've ever done. I'm here in the shadows. Yeah, honestly, I'm just gonna build two uh, best bean geysers, and then really, I'm not gonna. A Zerg force is preparing to move on the core matrix. Warriors, defend the core! Here we go, ready? Look at this. I walk the shadowed path. We are one with the shadow. 
You have not enough minerals. Oh, no. I walk the shadowed path. I think you can get faster mineral harvesting in the other two campaigns. I don't remember though. So we just wait. I don't even know where this. You should head out and destroy the null circuits. The purifiers will attack the Zerg and slow their attacks upon the core. The heart of darkness. This is enough, though. I return to serve. I walk the shadowed paths. There, a null circuit. Destroy it, and power should begin to flow again. I am detecting a purifier awakening on its own. Wait, something is amiss. The AI has gone rogue. Its solarite memory lattice has grown irreversibly unstable. We should disable it. At least we can put its solarite to use. flow increasing exponentially. It's working! The purifiers are activating! I am Executor Polarian. I address the leader of the Firstborn. Executor Polarian, your deeds are taught to all Templar, even to this day. Seize your adjuration. Why do you seek the purifiers? Brothers, you were created to protect the Empire. Yet we did not treat you as you deserved. As true Templar. I implore you to forgive our ancestors' mistakes. To take 
take up your ancient charge once more and join us as equals. We will see if you speak truth. You will aid us in purifying this alien threat. Only then shall we discuss this further. Sentinels! Advance upon the alien stronghold! Purify the invaders! I walk the shadowed path. Alright, well, I think there's the train to go. I'm looking for this thing, which is gonna be a lot of fun. You must construct additional pylons. <laughs> Okay, well this creep will probably clear up soon enough and I'll be able to... Well, not the creep. Yeah, they Shadows. Oh, 
Okay. Unity through purpose. I think I got two of them. For Artemis. I will comply. Olak Natal. And Taro Tassadar. As ever, I serve. I serve. The core matrix is under attack. It must not fall. Enemies meet the enemy. I return to first. No circuits destroyed. Station at half power. Construct additional pylons. I am here. In Purifiers! Our home is under assault by alien forces. Move out and eliminate them. Additional pylons. Pylons, that's fine. is at 75% power. I figured they were going to do that eventually. Your thoughts are clear. I heed the call. Brothers, our time has come. 
Eliminate the alien bioforms with extreme prejudice. Unity through purpose. Alright, we're gonna go that way, I'll go this way. I am the voice of the eclipse. is awakening. Yep. Hierarch, Cybros has reached full power, and the purifiers are cleansing the station of the Zerg. Fight on, brothers. Slaughter them to the last. I've been disconnected from Cybros' systems. Commencing purification.
by allowing the purifier core matrix to lose all of its shields. Activate two purifier forces. Oh, okay. Well, fair enough. 